Hey guys, I am Nick Eisenbarth, lead engineer here at Van Duet. Today we're gonna to take a deep dive into our new move model. Let's get after it. This particular model is upfitted on a Ford Transit T350 um, high roof and a long chassis. Um, it's also equipped with all wheel drive and a 3.5 EcoBoost. Up front, we have the Luminous Baja bumper. Um, we got two recovery points here. We got a Schmitty built 12,000 pound winch with a Factor 55 flat link right here and two Baja Designs LP6s up top. Moving up top, we have five Baja Designs LP9 lights. Um, we have two that are amber and the three center ones are going to be clear. We have these specced with a variety of light patterns to give the best coverage while you're going down the road. This fan has increased ride height. It is sitting on Bilstein struts in the front, Fox 2.0 shocks in the rear, and is wrapped with Black Rhino Sequoia wheels with BFG KO2 all terrains. We have the luminous driver's side step right here. Up top, we have two Baja Design work lights. At the back of the van, we have an extra window to increase ventilation. Down here, we got a two inch receiver with a backwoods rear bumper. This has built-in reverse lights for extra lighting. Right here, driver's side, we have an aluminous ladder rack um, with a full-size spare on here. On the passenger side, we have a Van Duer branded backpack in partnership with Illuminous. Um, but it has some accessories mounted to it for setup for recovery. We got an ax, we got a shovel, some extra fuel, traction boards, and a five pound propane tank for our outdoor kitchen. On the top of this rack, we have two 100 watt panels for a total of 200 watts of solar power. We have a max air fan and a Dometic AC. And then back here at the back, we have a electrical junction box on top of the roof. And so, if you add accessories later on down the road, you can do it with ease. On the passenger side, we have a matching rear sliding window with a 10 foot Thule awning. Set right below that, we have two more Baja Design work lights. Down here, we have the luminous passenger side step. As you step inside, one of the first things you're gonna notice is that we use aluminum extrusion as the base of our framework. We pair that with aluminum and composite materials this is because we want to minimize odor retention and maximize your build's durability. Starting up front, we have driver and passenger side custom leather swivel seats. We have a lagoon table for some work at the passenger seat. And we have what we call the bulkhead shelf, which provides easy to access, good usable storage. All right, here in the living space, we have a few cool features to add. We have a quick disconnect water hose. We have a toilet on a slide out so you can use the restroom anywhere you go. On this one, we have our pod set up with four drawers. And then here we have a sink set up with a Dometic fridge underneath. Looking behind that sink, we have a cubby space right here that's set up for storage. It does have outlets on both sides so you got all the power you need. And then looking up top, we have what we call our overhead or airplane style storage. And that's gonna run front to back on the driver's side and then on the back section on the passenger side. This van is equipped with a full size bed, sleeping side to side. And as you can see, we have both of our sliding windows up here so you can get that ventilation across your body. Um, th this bed does fold drawbridge style up like so. And then you also have a TV here so you can watch in bed or it swivels so you can watch it from the front. We went ahead and put the mattresses on this side, all the pillows right here, simply fold up right here, and then fold up right here. This van is equipped with 16 adjustable dome lights. They can pivot side to side. Um, they are also zoned in four different zones and they are dimmable. You also have zoned RBGW accent lights. Also on the ceiling, you have the Max Air Deluxe fan up top. Uh, this creates a lot of extra ventilation when you open these windows. Paired with that, we have the Dometic RTX 2000 DC operated air conditioner. This really cuts the humidity on those hot summer days. 
Back here on our passenger side, we're gonna have our modular water box. This is gonna have 22 gallons of fresh water storage. It's gonna have a 1.5 gallon hot water tank with a mixer right here that controls your front and rear quick disconnects. For our power system, we have three Masterbolt 3000 batteries that equates out to 720 amp hours of battery capacity. That goes through the Masterbolt Combi Master, which gives 3,500 watts of inverting capacity. Um, this is also paired with the automatic transfer switch that gives 200 amps of charge from shore power to these batteries. Um, charging from the alternator, we have two Mac 50s that go directly from the alternator to charge these batteries and that has a capacity of 100 amps. And then for our solar up top, we have a Victron solar controller that allows 30 amps of charging capacity. Behind all that, controlling everything, we have a C-Zone system that controls all your switching and loads. On the bottom here, we have the S-Bar. That's gonna tap into our factory fuel tank and that is gonna keep your van completely warm in the winter time. All right, now that we're at the back doors, we kind of left these as a blank slate for you to set up however you want. We have five extrusion bars that you can pretty much bolt anything to. As you see here, we have a fold-away table that's set up for a grill. Um, we got some molly panel with some filtration hooked up here. We also have our Baja Designs interior lights that give you a little bit more working light in this back area. On this side, we have a fire extinguisher. Uh, we got our extension cord, and then we got our recovery gear that is specced out to this specific chassis. Um, and if you need to, you can turn these knobs, grab this bag, and go ahead and go make a recovery. All right, that's it for our new move model. If you guys have any questions, follow up with a van guru and they'll get them answered for you. Go ahead and follow us on social media to, if you want to see more to come on this van. All right, sweet. Thank you.